Yeah. Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Today I got an unboxing for you guys from Games. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with Games, remember the little portable suitcase that I had for my NBA 2K15 video? Well, today I'm going to be unboxing one of their newest products, which is called the M155. Now, everybody knows that I do a lot of traveling. I work at the airport. I fly free, so I'm always on the go. Now, they've come up with something where I can actually game while on an airplane. And I was thinking about it. I was like, nah, that's not too possible until I seen the M155 at PAX last year. Now, I've been wanting to get my hands on one of these drones for about a year now. And today is the day where I can actually get my paws on it. So I'm going to be unboxing it. Uh, it comes with a few other things as well as just a monitor. But I'm going to give you guys a clear description of everything that's in the box. So let's hop into it. All right, guys. So just to let you know, we aren't dealing with something small here. This is a gaming monitor plus backpack. This is a very, very, very tall box. I mean, it's insanely tall. And this is what it looks like. Now, I'm going to be giving you guys a demonstration of how it works and the specifications that you need. And I hope you guys will be happy with that. Now, uh, I'm not going to try to have you guys put on your glasses to try to read the back of the box. But I just want to show you guys all four sides of the box because I know how some people get. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and pull this flap here. Make sure there's nothing on the sides. Hold up. I got my handy dandy knife. Just making sure. You know what I'm saying? Hold up. Just got to make sure there's no tape on the sides. All right. Now that she's open, I really, I really want to stand up. Like, y'all don't understand. All right. So, first thing uh, is after you take the backpack out, the box is empty. That's it. The only reason for the size of that box is for this backpack. All right. So now that we have the backpack here, I'm going to go ahead and unstrap it. Uh, so basically, it comes with these two straps here. Now, what you want to do is just want to unstrap it. Now, the reason for that flap, I was talking to the VP of games at uh, E3 this year, and he was telling me that the reason that they made this overlap is because when people have all their belongings, people can easily walk up to them in a line, start talking to them, and start pulling up their zipper and take their stuff out. So he said the best way for this bag to perform the way it is is if you have the zippers all the way at the top and then put the flap down. So so if anybody wants to steal your stuff, you're obviously going to feel somebody trying to put their hand to feel where your zipper is. No homo. But uh, <laughs> let's open up the box. Uh, uh oh, hold up. We have some foam. I've been waiting on that. Yeah. All right. So, what do we have here? We have the monitor. Oh, yeah. Sleek. Look at that. All right, I'm going to put this down. I'll be with that in a moment. We have some other things in here. Now, this right here is the holding key for the M155. So, let's see if we have anything else in here besides, ah, silica. Now, kids, don't chew on this, all right? All right, let's see if we have anything in here. Let's go down in here, see, see if he left any gifts. No, nobody left any gifts. Just some more foam. All right, so, the bag has two compartments. Um, I'm guessing this compartment is for your... Uh, either your M155 or you can probably now you can't fit a console in that you can't fit a console in that but you can fit a console here and I think they made it that big for the Xbox you can also put a little oh hold on a little computer and stuff but what's the I didn't even see that mother sucker y'all got trick compartments hold on it's something in here it might be just foam though ah uh, the handy dandy Cords. You got a HDMI cord and a USB, micro USB cord to charge the M155. And you also have some clamps here. I'm going to figure out what those go to. 
Oh, man, what's this? Hold up. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and break that. Oh, it even comes with a USB block. Just in case you want to use the wall. Okay, cool. Anything else they hiding from me? This thing comes with all kinds of tricky compartments. I think that's it. That's, 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 that's just about it. Cool. Now, I have it set up. It is fully functional. Everything is a go. The screws are locked in. The monitor is ready to be used. But, I want to go over the monitor for a second. Now, as I look at the bottom, there are no ports. I look at the right side, no ports. I look at the top, no ports. But on the left, there are a few ports here, plus buttons. Now, the ports are hidden, so you know you can put like this little, little gummy to cover the ports. That's pretty good because dust is a mother. I mean a mother. Now the buttons, the buttons are for volume, brightness, and it looks like a menu button here as well. I'm gonna check that out after I turn it on. Plus, of course, the power button. So this is like a little mini TV. Now, I'm looking to see if there are any speakers and I don't think there are any speakers. I think you can only play with these with headphones. And most likely the only reason for that is because if you're out and about with this, you probably wanna be discreet. So uh, I'm gonna show you guys a little fold mode real quick so all right my hands is a flat surface right now look at that balance do you he, do you see my hand shaking not at all so this is how deep you can have it you know it just got three little ridges here and that ridge is pretty deep that's like it's like like a laptop type feel to it all right so now that it is unboxed, it is set up. I have a few cords here and I have a PS4. Do you guys want to see it in action? If you do, make sure you like the video. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you are currently looking at a PS4 running with a M155 with only one outlet being used. Now, what I can show you guys is, I got my controller, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Tosi Stickers for the decal, by the way. You know what I'm saying? Loving the Batman Arkham joint. Um, also, the volume is on 100%, all right? So, it's coming through my headphones, through my beats. And I'm going to put them next to the mic so you guys can hear when I click a button. So, here we go. All right. Now, check this out. These two USBs are being used by the M155. I'm going to test it to see if I can pull out one to see if it will still work. I don't know if you need both cores to get the maximum charge for the M155, but we will see. Now, uh, right before I pull out this cord, I want to test the audio for you guys. Alright, let's see. The easiest way to test audio is to go to something I already did. Alright, so that just came on my headphones. I had them right next to the mic. So it's pretty loud. Now, even if I have the headphones right here, let me test that out as well. All right, so just to let you guys know, everything is intuitive. Everything works well. I can play this game on this con this uh, screen without any lag or anything. Everything looks pretty good. You can even tell the graphics look great. Now the brightness, the brightness uh, is not on 100%. Let me check the brightness, by the way. Let me just see real quick. All right, so the brightness is on 70. Like I said, the volume is on 100. And let's see what this little button here does. All right, so that's the, like I said, that's the menu button. So this thing comes with menu, 
volume and brightness now like I told you guys I'm gonna pull out this cord to see what happens So let's see if it cuts off oh it doesn't cut off it doesn't cut off at all it doesn't need the secondary cord so if you have like a Bluetooth headset like an Astro headset or something you can ball out with Astros on a plane because Astros only need one USB port with the optical in and out because they're not wireless like internet they're wireless Bluetooth so let me no you know what I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try I'm not gonna try them I know what you guys are thinking why don't you try the Astros Nah, not today not today so is this nice yes it is will I be using it on a plane yes I will now that I have this I can travel in luxury and leisure and I think I may even videotape myself on a plane playing a video game what do you guys think do you think I should actually go on an airplane and play this game I don't know we'll see we'll see but uh if you guys want that type of video you know what I'm saying make sure you thumbs this one up leave a comment below on what you think about this product and uh, let me know if you guys want to get one, you know, maybe I'll ask the company, you know, what type of coupons they got rolling out, you know, soon or something like that. I'll keep you guys posted, but it's probably going to be a link in the description to this product. And um, I will have to say the screen isn't small, man. The screen don't look small at all. Like I could ball out on this. Like I could, let me, let me go down to some people. Let me see, let me see if there's other people around I could fight and stuff like that. Let's go. All right. I see people. Anybody want to hit me? Okay. Oh, yeah. Double take down. Oh, back ring. Oh, got your back. Gotcha. Woo, woo. I'm getting my behind. What? Oh, yeah. Did he just slap me in the back of my neck? See that button smashing going on right now? Oh, did he just power slam me? All right, I think I'm done, y'all. I think this this video is is a wrap. I'm just having fun right now with some Batman. What y'all know about that?